Whatever your life story, you deserve access to comprehensive, affordable health insurance. But it can be hard to know where to start. That's why Minnesotans have Minsure. Minsure is where you can find health coverage for every Minnesota story, regardless of where you live or what your income is. Minsure is the only place where you can access savings to help lower the cost of your health coverage. And you can get free help in person or over the phone to enroll in a plan that fits your needs and your story. Visit Minsure.org today to get started. Finally tired of doing the same things over and over again, expecting different results? Well, this show is going to help you change your life for the better. Strap on your seatbelt and navigate this roller coaster we call life with human potential expert and best-selling author, Dr. Verna Price. Each week, Dr. Verna blesses you with her virtues to live your best life so you can be the best you that you can be. Welcome back to Dr. Vernon's Virtues. So glad you joined me again. And for those of you who are brand new to the podcast, welcome. Glad you came. Please listen in and tell your friends and subscribe as well. So I, I was walking around uh, this morning thinking to myself, it's it's Thanksgiving. Um, it's a time of, of just being thankful. It's a time of reflection. And I thought to myself, how blessed we are so many of us we're so blessed and by blessed i mean that they, we have so much in our lives there's so much going on there's so much good in our lives and what came to me for this podcast is just one phrase and this phrase says lest we forget lest we forget but before we start let's go ahead and start with our affirmation and um I am going to, let's just do the one I was born affirmation, just to remind you of who you are. Put your hand on your heart and repeat after me. When I was born, I was born valuable. When I was born, I was born important. When I was born, I was born lovable. And when I was born, I was born extremely powerful. Yes, you were. You have been powerful since the day that you were born. You came from your mother's womb filled with power, lest we forget. In our lives when we have so much, in our lives when there's so much good happening, in our lives when there's so much that we have going on for us, sometimes we can take that for granted. We can take the things in our lives that's really a blessing for granted. And now some of the things in in, in your life, you may think to yourself, you know what, Dr. Verna, I, I am struggling today. But I can tell you, lest you forget, there are some things in your life that you can still be thankful for. Did you get up this morning? You can be thankful for that. Were you able to get up and use your legs and walk this morning? You can be thankful for that. For those of you who say, well, Dr. Vernon, you know what? I don't even like my job. Do you have a job? You can be thankful for that. For those of you who say, you know what, Dr. Verna? You know, my children are really a problem. Do you have children? You can be thankful for that. Lest we forget. Because we can sometimes operate in all of these blessings what I would call natural blessings. But the truth is that they're supernatural blessings. You can walk, that's supernatural. I was I gave birth to a son who they said would never walk. And today Cornelius walks. It's a blessing. You can see that is a blessing. You can think clearly that is a blessing, lest we forget. What I want you to do during this holiday season, I want you to look around your life and just start saying thank you. Just start being thankful for all the things around your life, all the people around your life. And what I want you to think to yourself is lest you forget who has been kind to you, who has been helpful to you, Lest you forget that your body still works. Lest you forget that you are still alive. Lest you forget who helped you in the time of need. Lest you forget that, yes, you do. You may not love your job, but you still get a paycheck. And that paycheck still pays your mortgage and your car note and for your children to go to college. Lest you forget 
Because sometimes it's easy to overlook those things and just take them for granted. You take it for granted that you, you know, you have a nice apartment. You don't have to have an apartment. You don't have to have an apartment. I live, I live in, in my community right down from my office. Right down from my office, there's a homeless park. And our brothers and sisters are in that homeless park. You don't have to have a house. Lest you forget that that house has heat in it and it's warm, particularly where I live here in Minnesota, having heat in your house is a blessing, lest you forget. And for those of you who say, well, Dr. Vernon, I am homeless. Well, lest you forget, you're homeless, but you can still find some place to go. You can still find some place to, to, to be secure. Your body still works. You can still use your mind. Lest you forget. So in these moments when we feel as though maybe we want to complain about something, or maybe we are just, just, just kind of going along and floating along in our blessings, what I want you to know is lest you forget and be thankful. And for some of you, you, can, you know, I'm not even saying be grateful because being grateful means taking thanks to another level. I remember uh, working when we were working in, uh, with women in prison. And I remember this woman saying to me, um, she said, you know, I, I, cannot, I, I cannot, you know, get beyond the fact that my mother abused me. And I said to her, I said, well, apparently she didn't kill you because you're standing here and you are talking to me. So lest you forget that you still have life, you can still start again. You're now learning how to change your life. Lest you forget that you have all of these things in your life. So what I want you to do is literally move beyond your past. And I'm not saying you have to be grateful for a mother who, who abused you. Absolutely not. What I'm saying to you is be thankful for whatever you have left. Whatever you have left, be thankful for it. You still have your voice, be thankful. You still have your body, be thankful. You still have your family, be thankful. Lest we forget. Let me tell you, during this season, do not forget your blessings. Count every last one of them and treat them like you've seen them for the first time. Walk into your house like you've seen your house for the first time and say, I'm so thankful. Look at your children like you've seen them for the first time and say, I'm so thankful. Go into your job next week like, you, like it's your first day there and say to yourself, I'm so thankful. For those of you who are, you know, you, whether you you drive a, a luxury car or whether you drive what I call a hoopty, you know what? Lest we forget that your car takes you down the street, you can be thankful for that. Be thankful for every little thing. Here's my homework to you. During this holiday and Thanksgiving season, I want you to find as many things as possible to be thankful for. And I want you to have a heart full of thanks. And in those moments where you feel like you want to complain about something, like something isn't cooked right, it don't look right, and someone didn't say something right, mm -mm. resist it, resist it. And just think to yourself, lest I forget, lest I forget how blessed I really am. All right, thank you for joining me today with Dr. Vernon's Virtues. Do your work of being thankful and I'll see you next time and make sure that, that, that you look around, look around for all the things you can be thankful for. All right, let's go ahead and finish up with our affirmation. When I was born, I was born valuable. When I was born, I was born important. When I was born, I was born lovable. And when I was born, I was born extremely powerful. Thanks for joining me. See you next time. Bye. Get caught up on previous episodes of Dr. Verna's Virtues at ShalettaMakesMeLaugh.com. When my father-in-law came to live with me five years ago, I was overwhelmed by all the important decisions I had to help him make. 
especially the one about choosing the right Medicare plan. They got more than 100 plans alone in Minnesota, so how was I supposed to know which one was right for him? Thank goodness for the senior linkage line. It's a free statewide service of the Minnesota Board on Aging in partnership with Trellis and the other area agencies on aging. They connect us to services and supports to help us find the answers we need. And honey, it's free. Did y'all hear me? Free help getting the best Medicare plan for you and your loved ones. The folks at the Senior Linkage Line, let me tell y'all something about them. They really care. They will work with you to figure out if your medications are covered. That way you know ahead of time what you're gonna pay out of pocket. So do like I did. Give them a call at 800-333-2433 or log on to trellisconnects.org. And y'all best hurry up, cause time is running out to change your Medicare plan. You got until Tuesday, December 7th to find one that's right for you. So don't wait, call the Senior Linkage Line today at 800-333-2433 or log on to trellisconnects.org. Let them help you like they helped me. You'll be glad you did. It never fails. Every fall, I fall into a funk. Daylight savings time used to have me singing the blues until I found some help at betterhelp.com. Better H E L P.com. It's an online resource that matches you with your own licensed professional therapist. Listen, Ain't no shame in talking to somebody about how you feel. Your mom and your friends are great to talk to when you have problems. They're your go-to. But sometimes you need a professional. And that's where you need to call BetterHelp.com. Sometimes it's the only way to get your happy back. BetterHelp.com offers secure online counseling, either over the phone or via video. Now it's not a crisis line, but BetterHelp.com has counselors who'll help you with your anger, stress, depression, or anxiety. The good news is that they're more affordable than traditional in-person counseling sessions. But you know what? If your money is funny, don't worry. BetterHelp.com even offers financial aid. Let BetterHelp.com help you get your happy back. Log on today to BetterHelp.com.